right, so today we got a very special episode. It is the 20th anniversary of Perfect Dark for the Nintendo 64. Now, I wanted to do something special, so I went and grabbed a sealed copy here. We're gonna open this up and see what's inside and then give a quick review as always. I also got the Perfect Dark Nintendo Power Players Guide here. We'll go through that real quick. Possibly one of the greatest N64 games. Definitely the best FPS on the system. And that's why it deserves a lot of respect. But before we're gonna open this up, let's check out the box art here. You got the Perfect Dark logo. You got Joanna Dark there looking badass. Pistol, laser sight there. Very cool graphics. You do need the expansion pack there for maximum gameplay. As you can see, it is one to four players simultaneous and published by Rare. The folks that brought you GoldenEye, this was kind of the successor to GoldenEye. They improved upon the game in so many different areas. Here's the backside, some screenshots there. A lot of cool different weapons and the levels were just amazing. Here's the description. Carrington Institute, hate those guys. Here's the expansion pack info. What you get with and without it. So it's kind of funny. You got, like you, you can't even play solo missions without it. Like that's pretty crazy. And that's about all there is to it. Let's get right into opening this thing. I'm not gonna use a knife. I'm gonna open it like I'm a kid back in the 2000 era, you know? This is gonna feel great. Here we go. Oh yeah. Take that off, slide that off. Look at that. Fresh game, fresh box. We're gonna get right into the contents here. You got a couple inserts there. Here's the manual. Wow, absolutely fresh. And then of course, whoops. We have the game cartridge, perfectly wrapped, absolutely minty fresh. Look at that, a little dust in there, but that's all right. Look at this minty cartridge. We'll put that aside and go on to the instruction booklet right away here. So here's your controls, basic controls, similar to GoldenEye, I'm sure most of you guys have played that. The quick menu. Cam Spy, getting started. Of course, a big, big fan of the multiplayer there. The sim mode and stuff like that was amazing. And then of course, cooperative. You know, the fact you can play this game, the campaign mode, cooperative, just elevated this game to a whole new level. And that's my favorite part of this game. Here are the characters. You got Joanna Dark, Jonathan, Daniel and Cassandra, everyone hates this chick. Just the worst human. And that's about it for the instruction manual. I'll go to the cartridge here. Of course, I gotta take these out, so I'll skip ahead. All right, so I got the screws out. Pop that off. Take the shield off and check out the circuit board. Look at that. Never been used. Absolutely flawless. And before we get on to a review, we'll check out this player's guide real quick. Look at that. Exclusive Perfect Dark comic inside. We'll just skim through this thing. I believe it goes, look at this. Badoom, love that. Amazing comics here. This is probably one of the best player's guides I've ever seen. And this one is in very good shape. Look at it, it goes through every single level, every single campaign mission and gives you tips. So. This is well worth the money. Definitely an amazing player's guide. And now let's get on to a quick review. Oh yeah, Rareware. So epic, love this intro. Brings back a lot of good memories. Perfect Dark, here we go, 20 years later. Oh yeah accessing the computer this whole this whole menu screen was actually very innovative look at this you can back out and it's like a lobby i forgot about this 
Joanna. Look at this. It's good to see you. Come with me. It's a game I'll within a game. The training rooms. This is crazy. The N64. You know, I'm surprised they don't do this that often. You know, with today's games on the Xbox One and stuff. I'm gonna go right back into it here. Access the computer and get right into some solo missions. Here we go, level one. I'm gonna do, um, you know, the easy mode just for time's sake. Get through it quickly. We'll just check out this intro real quick because it's just so iconic. The tunes. You can hear that golden eye kind of chime in there, Mind man. The Here we go. Woohoo! Falcon 2 Silencer. Now, controls are a little wonky, just like golden eye. Take that guy out. Got that silence. Pistol. No one can hear it. It's coming in. Got the CMP 150. But we ain't gonna use it. I know this level inside and out. Played it millions of times. Millions of times. Especially co op. I love playing with a friend. The best thing. Playing this game on co op. Definitely my favorite part of the game. And honestly, what are the missions? Gain entrance to the laboratory. I think all I have to do is go down. Now we're going down to the bottom floor. First level is pretty simple, uh, especially on Agent. Get her. Here we go. Love this music. The is increased, make it a little more intense. We'll go around here. Make sure you use those C buttons. Definitely helps um, your movement speed things up, you know what I'm saying? Secret door right here. That's it. Be first level already. Like a boss. Huh? Also great. Huh? An empty elevator. What? Smack! <laughs> Love it. These cutscenes in between levels just added to that storyline experience. It's just perfectly made, to be honest. What's up, dude? You just standing there? Damn, yo. Oh. I think I got a um, left bumper or what? Does anyone know how to change the cam spy? There we go. Thought there's a different way, but maybe my controls are different. We're in this cam spy. We're taking pictures of this isotope, and that's all there is to it. There we go. The first objective. This part was actually probably my least favorite from when I was the other way. Stupid robot. I gotta catch up to it. Go, 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 go. I ain't waiting for this. Ah, made it. Take that, you stupid robot. Look at this. You gotta follow this thing. Sometimes if you caught on the way back, you'd have to wait like... Man, a good minute. Now, if I recall correctly, there's some... Uh, ooh. Some of these guys right here. Let's take those out. There you go! Already beat level 2. This game is amazing. Look at these characters. What? It's a, it's a flying laptop. Very professional, done, my dear. This is the future, people. No We're in the future waste. here. You must leave. I think this game was set 2023, which is three years away. I don't think we're gonna have flying laptops by then. And I think that's about all I'm gonna do today. I played two missions, and what's there to say about this game? 20 years later, still a banger. I think they even made a remastered version on the Xbox. You can download it, very cheap, like six or seven dollars. I'm probably gonna play through that myself soon. As for review, you know what, this is getting, this is knock out of the park. Graphics, 10 out of 10. Gameplay, 10 out of 10. 
and soundtrack 10 out of 10 is a perfect game and if you haven't played it i don't know what you're doing with your life thanks for tuning in make sure you hit that subscribe button we'll see you next time